the kennel goat novices hurdle is next in this is a two mile novices hurdle uh, grade two again and you can see it looks like we've got one or two newcomers in this as well um, let's take a look at the full list william tell is at the top for ryan tamasebi three times a winner in the last six Paul Gallopin for Darren Thompson's also won twice in the last five and seven Spanish Angels. Ryan Tamasebi's won twice in the last six as well. Kingdom All Ireland for Joshua Sutherland's also a winner. So's Nashara Blitz for Darren Thompson. Purdy King for Martin Little. Looks like he'll have to punch above his weight. Royal Sultan for Jim Murray. Sierra Messiah for Craig Allen. Could be anything. So could Yorkshire Rock David Hooley. Do Hasley on Van Rinsburg. Gallant Zara Craig Allen. Golf Blinder David Robertson. Kingdom of Whiskey. Joshua Sutherland. Rainbird David Hooley. Red Flag Daily on Van Rinsburg and Zara. It's Craig Beckwith. They're off and racing and heading towards the first of the flights in this novice hurdle and they're all safely over that one with golf blinder a little bit slow at the back but david robertson's got a lot of horses that sit out the back for the first circuit and then appear on the scene at the business end of the race they get to the second already and they're over that one nicely and spread right across the track and there's a leading three two of which are Darren Thompson charges and the Shara Blitz and Paul Gallopin with in between those two forming a kind of arrow formation is Zarek for Craig Beckwith who's the clear leader passing the winning post then and there's the big Ascot stand in the background the grey Sierra Messiah who's a newcomer has gone into fourth well, on the outside down on this near side is Kingdom of Whiskey that's another newcomer for Joshua Sutherland I think then seven Spanish Angels is after that one Royal Sultan is next and then comes uh, Yorkshire Rock David Hooley's got two in this, and the purple colours both look pretty similar. And uh, Leon van Rensburg has got two as well, as you can see. One or two trainers are doubly represented in this. Towards the back, golf blinder William Tell and Purdy King are the back three. As so they make their way to the third flight, which they're all safely over. Kingdom of Whiskey jumped it nicely on the inside, but Zarex is the clear leader now by two to Nashara Blitz in second and Paul Gallup in third. Then Sierra Messiah is in fourth as they get over that one and the video is juddering and sticking again so we may just find ourselves out of sync by the time we get to the business end of the race if the video is all right on upload. So get into the fifth then. And then also over that one Sierra Messiah was a little bit untidy and lost a few lengths in the air. Pearly King is the new back marker but Zarex continues to lead from the Darren Thompson pair, Nashara Blitz and Paul Gallup in second and third. Kingdom of Whiskey is fourth. Then Duhast is coming around the outside with Sierra Messiah and then Royal Sultan. Then comes Yorkshire Rock. Seven Spanish Angels is after that one. Kingdom All Island is next. Then William Tell getting a little bit closer. So to his red flag. That golf blind has gone past a few and their rain bird gallant Zara and Pearly King who is at the back as they take number six. And they're all still hurdling well with Zarex continuing to show the way Kingdom of Whiskey though is getting much closer and Sierra Messiah just being pushed along in there jockey having a little look round see where the rest of them are also coming through there really well now is Duhas as they take the third from home and it's Zarex who's the clear leader Zarex is still too clear of Kingdom of Whiskey and Nashara Blitz on the inside Duhast is next then comes Sierra Messiah and Royal Sultan Yorkshire Rock is after that one it's still a wide open race but they've got to get to Zarex and Zarex has kicked on again in front he's now three clear it's Zarex three clear of Duhast in second, Nashara Blitz is third. Yorkshire Rocks looking for some room. He's got nowhere to go at the moment. Round the outside, Sierra Messiah is trying to get it. Kingdom of Whiskey is still there over the second last they go, and it's still Zarex from Duhas. But now Kingdom of Whiskey in third place, and also on the near side, Yorkshire Rocks now got some racing room. They're coming down towards the final flight then now, and it's still Zarex in the lead. But now Kingdom of Whiskey throws out a big challenge. It's Kingdom of Whiskey on the outside of Zarex. Zarex on the inside. Kingdom of Whiskey goes into the lead. Is this another good one from the Joshua Sutherland stable? It's Kingdom of Whiskey who's in the lead. Zarex is next in the shower of bits and Yorkshire Rock with William Tell's trying to run, but it's Kingdom of Whiskey still in the lead. Here comes Yorkshire Rock. Kingdom of Whiskey from Yorkshire Rock. Kingdom of Whiskey is just about holding on from Yorkshire Rock. Second, the shower of bits is third. Zarex was next in Rainbird and all the way back to Pearly King, who was anything but a king today. And I think that's a newcomer 1 2, and that might just be the case it is in fact kingdom of whiskey for joshua sullivan the winner yorkshire rock for david hooley second the shara blitz for darren thompson third zarex fourth for craig beckwith and rainbird fifth for david hooley so one two for newcomers and i think that might just add to the argument of those of us who don't agree with the transfer window